एक्स्ट्रा टाइम Absolutely, very confident. As a, as you just recently shown, we can we're more than capable of turning things around very quickly, um, and we've got to make sure that we get ourselves in a frame of mind over the next couple of days to do just that. Um, so you know, there's every confidence that we can go up to Old Trafford and, and get a win. Two hours of delivery, wish you a speedy recovery. No medication now, no need to miss. चाहिए Um, but it also, you've got to look at how we responded from Lords and the performance we put in at Headingley, um, and we've got a lot to do exactly the same when we get to Old Trafford now. How confident? How confident are you and the guys that you can still salvage something from this series? Absolutely, very confident. As a, as you've just recently shown, we can we're more than capable of turning things around very quickly, um, and we've got to make sure that we get ourselves in a frame of mind over the next couple of days to do just that. Um, so, you know, there's every confidence that we can go up to Old Trafford and, and get a win. If that's to happen, what needs to be ch- changed? What needs to improve? Well, I think you look at this game. I mean, it's been frustrating today to lose ten wickets, um, but uh, I think actually where the game was lost or where we could have really stamped our authority on things was was earlier in the game. I think we should have got a bigger lead first time round with the bat. Um, Now it'd be nice to have another hundred runs, actually, uh, and then we're looking at a very different, uh, very different game. Um, so I think we've got to be a little bit more ruthless there. Those first innings runs there, I think that really cost us. And as well, our catching, uh, we, we did put down a few chances. Some of them were extremely difficult. Um, that has to be said. But at the same time, you give chances and half chances to world class players. They they take them, and um, we've seen that throughout this game. And will you rest and rotate the attack at Old Trafford, James Anderson? Four Test back. We'll have to look at things. We, you know, we'll, we'll see how everyone pulls up the next couple of days, and we'll we'll be try and make um, smart decisions around that. I mean, it's been a frustrating summer in terms of um, our bowling resources went from having so many to a lot of injuries to contend with. So you know, we'll have to try and manage that as well as we can, and and make sure that we've got an attack that um, can take twenty wickets at Old Trafford. Will that be his decision? Will you ask Jimmy how are you feeling? How will you come to the decision? I think you have to weigh everything up. You have to take everything into account and make sure that physically he's in the right place to be able to play a test match, but also and that he can he feels that he can get through it. Um, because at the same time, you know, even with his quality, if he goes down injured, it, it leaves us in a very difficult place, not only for the rest of the game but for the winter as well. So. Look, we have to be smart about it. We have to make sure we make the right calls. Um, uh, but ultimately, uh, we, we've got to try and find a way of winning as well. So it's a, it's a delicate balancing act, and uh, one that we'll try and make sure we get right. Um, you, you mentioned that word ruthlessness uh, before. You, you, you mentioned it just there to James, and actually after the last game, you talked about doubling down and not letting sort of the the position slip that you got. Do you feel like? For all the talent in the side, do you feel like you are a ruthless side or a hard team? I think um, I think we've something that we've got to get better at. I think it's something that we've got to keep looking to improve um, and recognizing those key moments in games and 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 enforcing it a little bit more. We did it very well at Headingley, um, and I think we didn't quite manage to do it this time round. So it's something that we've got to be more consistent at. With a lot of other things within um, this format, we've got to look to be more consistent at. Um, A, a few different things, and I think that mindset. You look at that spell from Bumrah and recognise a key moment in the game, uh, and turn the game on its head this afternoon. It's something that we've got to look to make sure that we we're doing as well. Yeah, yeah. Obviously, we know that you can't win the series now, having having lost the series to New Zealand. It's how big of a point of pride is that to to make sure you don't. I guess like the Ashes maybe in 2019 that you don't let India get out here with a with a win under the belt. Absolutely, because you never want to um, you never want to see. Uh, Well, you never want to lose any test series, so it's going to be really important that we um, we we bounce back very quickly, just as we did a week ago, um, and put in a similar sort of performance up, up when we get to Old Trafford. 
Can I just ask about the, the approach today and, and kind of what, what the plan was? Obviously, it didn't end up working, but um, what, yeah, what, what your approach was to that chase? I think we had to earn the right to, um, to get ourselves in a position to dictate terms. Um, it was always going to have to be the case that we, we would need wickets in hand. Uh, and we certainly set things up nicely going into to lunch. It would have been nice to be only one down. Um, but um, it was more if, we, if we'd got in a position near T where, um, you know, we had wickets in hand then we could have definitely looked to put our foot on the gas and, and put India under pressure. And, you know, when there's wickets in hand there, you, you always feel like it's score quickly. Um, India would have probably had to be a little bit more defensive with some of the fields. And they would have been, had that in the back of the mind that we'd, chasing it down but unfortunately we couldn't quite take it deep enough um, and, and that was a wonderful that, that really turned the game they, they got the ball reversing nicely and they took advantage of it and we just didn't have the right answers which is slightly frustrating and, and as I mentioned earlier be a little bit more ruthless at certain points in the game it's looking at certain situations and saying right I'm going to grab this moment and um, and take take on that I guess in that advantageous position which um, goes on to, to be so crucial within within a test match. You just talked about being more ruthless. How do you learn ruthlessness? How do you teach ruthlessness? By putting yourself out there time and time again, putting yourself in a position um, to, to go and do that. And, and that's all you can ask of the group. Uh, until you've actually done it, it's very hard to, to explain. But you know, you've got to look at a certain situation if you get around the ball or if you're 30 not out. You go on and you uh, have that bit between your teeth and, and you turn the game and get that big part ship with your mate at the other end, make a big hundred, or you you know, you, you get a couple of quick wickets and um, and take advantage of some um, some conditions that are in your favour and um, and turn the game on its head. So we've done it, we've done it throughout the series, just not consistently enough. And um, you know, it's it's something that we'll keep looking to 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 try and focus on. Uh, Joe, does this go down as a case of missed opportunities. It's only four days ago that India were 127-7 on the opening day. Yeah, as I said, there's been a number of periods in the game where I felt like we were, we were ahead and we had a great a great chance. And, um, now to be sat here with nothing to, to show from the, the week is, is frustrating. There's no hiding from that. And um, there's, there's no point trying to sugarcoat it. We should have got something from this game. But it, I think we've got to look at the, the whole the whole test match, not look at isolated incidences and, and see collectively where we can get better. Um, and that's exactly what we will do. And we'll make sure that when we turn up to Old Trafford, we've got that bit between our teeth again. Uh, and we use this in a positive way to, to, to get ourselves ready for what's a very big game. Bounce back just like we did at Lords. Hit the subscribe option and the bell icon to get all the exclusive sports videos on Extra Time.